Did you know that a large portion of the dust in your home is actually made of you? About half of household dust comes from human skin cells. Every minute, your body sheds tens of thousands of dead skin cells, and indoors, they don't go far. They settle on floors, mixing with fabric fibers, hair pollen, pet dander, and even microscopic pieces of plastic. But why gray? It's the result of color mixing. When countless tiny fragments of different shades blend together, your eyes perceive the average, a dull gray. It's the same reason dryer lint and eraser crumbs always look the same. But dust doesn't just sit still. As particles move through the air, they build up static electricity, especially in dry environments. That charge pulls more particles in, helping dust clump together into what we call dust bunnies, especially under furniture or in low traffic corners. And it's not just humans. Pets contribute dander and anything you bring in from outside. Skin cells also make great food for dust mites, tiny organisms that live in bedding, carpets, and soft furniture. Their waste can trigger allergies and affect air quality, especially in enclosed spaces. Microscopic. Extremely small, only visible with a microscope. Particles. Tiny bits or pieces of matter.